Kareen Williams and Michael O'Hara. Kareen is the proud mother of Michael O'Hara, star, sprinter and hurdler for Calabar. Kareen, we noticed that um, you have been present at most of Michael's events and you're here now at a training session on a Saturday. Tell us why are you so supportive of Michael? I have been with Michael since he has been going to Smurf Prep School, that's where he started out from. And I remember once they put him in an event and they tried him there and he came in first in that 50 meter. So I decided to watch him there from then. So it's not just no, have been following up Michael from he was three years old on the track. And I'm close to him as a mom, knowing that he's my first boy also. And I always be there for my three children. Okay. Uh, Michael, how important has been your mother's support to your track and field career so far? Well, it is very important to me. Because knowing that most time when she's not around, I don't think about it when I'm going to the races. When, when I see her at, at the Jack it, it's even more confident to go out there and do my best. Okay. So, mommy, to, to the Jamaican moms, we have a lot, of, a lot of athletes in track and field in Jamaica. To the Jamaican moms, explain to them how important it is to, to, to support the kids in their track and field endeavors and any, any endeavors. to your children or child whether it's on the track or with the work because I'm not there with Michael alone when he's doing his events on the track or training sessions even at school I just pop up and visit Michael right and ask the teacher how we see going on and what help he needs to improve himself or you know just to assist him in his schoolwork I'm always there both on the track and at school. Speaking on that, tell us about Michael off the track. Okay. How is he at home? How is he with his schoolwork as he mentioned a while ago? Okay. At home, Michael is very pleasant, humble, a quiet child, never gives trouble. I've never met Michael before and I really thank God that he has blessed me with a child like this. <laughs> you know, and in his schoolwork, I'm always behind him, 110%. I always said to Michael, Michael, not just the track alone, the book, Michael, the book. You have to do your 100% in the book and on the track. And I encourage all mother out there to just to be close to their child or children and assist them in the best way possible. Okay, all right, Michael. You are one of Jamaica's top junior athletes and having your mother's support, would you think you'd be as good without her behind you as much? All right, you spoke about blessed, uh, mommy. You were a former athlete. Now we understand where Michael gets his talent from. Explain a little about your track and field career during your youth. Okay. Let me apologize. Daddy's not here just now, but he gives his 100%. And he also, you know, encouraged Michael on the phone. He calls him regularly on the phone, encourage him whether in his schoolwork or on the track. So I apologize for that not being here, but always there for Michael. Okay, Karine started out at a primary school in Manchester and 
I started out my track career in the 100, 200, and then leaving primary, going to high school where I do the 200, the 100, the 4x1, and uh, high jump, and long jump. I was champion girl for two years at the high school, and moving on to college, I was champion girl for two years during my three years in college. Okay, so what happened? Um, why you didn't go on to, you know, to the senior level? I decided to do some hard studies and I decided to quit. Because I believe in education. education. As I pumped in Michael, Michael, not the track alone, but education wise. So, Michael, how inspired were you to get into track and field based on your mother's history in the sport? Well, very inspired actually because growing up, my auntie used to run as well. Actually, the whole, the whole family used to run as well. So, that inspired me more to knowing that I would give me so again. Uh, Alright, so what, what are you expecting from Michael and Champs? Oh, well, let me say. Let us give God all the praise and the glory knowing that he is there for Michael and he will continue to be there with Michael and all he has to do is to go out there, do his best and just encourage himself to just go down and do his best. He is expected to create a lot of fireworks but even if it doesn't happen, you're just going to be behind him. You come in first, second, third, fourth. I am there, and with the help of Mr. Michael Clark, his coach, I appreciate him so far what he's doing, and you know we all should work as a team. All right, thank you very much, Karen Williams and Michael O'Hara.